Hello guys, here on varm24.com YouTube channel and today we'll disassemble Samsung Galaxy A53. The first thing we need to do is heat the surface of the back cover up to 158 degree Fahrenheit or 70 Celsius degree. For this we will use a heating mat, we place Samsung on the mat for 5-7 minutes to warm up the back cover. After that we need to take out the tray combined for SIM cards and a memory card. We insert the tool into the hole of the right, do not confuse it with the hole on the left which is for the microphone. We take a plastic film, insert it into the hole between the cover and the display frame and separate the back cover. We carefully move the film along the edge of the back cover. We detach the back cover, nothing special is presented on it. And unscrew the screws using a Philips H2O screwdriver. Please note that one screw is different in size, so you need to remember its location so as not to be confused when reassembling. And with a plastic tool we pry on one side and detach the cover hiding the printed circuit board. On the cover are antenna tracks and contact pads on the reverse side. And now disconnect the battery connector with a non-metal tool. After we unscrew the screws at the bottom, the screwdriver is the same, Philips 1.5mm or H3O. We hook the cover from the corner and detach the cover with a loudspeaker. There are no antenna tracks on this cover. Now we can disconnect the connector on the motherboard, the connector to the subboard and the connector to the display and remove the interboard cable. The arrow on the cable indicates the direction to the motherboard. And we disconnect the coaxial cable connectors and disconnect the fingerprint sensor connector. Now we need to unscrew two screws securing the subboard and do not mix up the screw holes when reassembling. Carefully detach the subboard. The subboard is recessed into the display frame and fix it with the clips. On the subboard we have a microphone, a card holder and a charging port. And we disconnect the connectors and remove the coaxial cables. Their location must also not be confused during reassembly. We detach the two rear cameras and we can also pry up on front camera. And we unscrew one screw securing the motherboard. Now we can carefully pry over the edge and remove the motherboard. We can turn over the printed circuit board, disconnect the connectors and remove the two rear cameras. So now we are done, thank you for watching, take care of yourself and see you around.
Okay guys, now we're done. Thank you for watching. If you like what we do, please consider subscribing to our YouTube channel or read our articles on our website. Take care of yourself and until next time.